This video explains the popular ant colony optimization algorithm, or what is commonly referred to as ACO. ACO stems from a branch of knowledge called swarm intelligence. Swarm intelligence is the discipline that deals with natural and artificial systems composed of many individuals that coordinate using decentralized control and self-organization. In particular, the discipline focuses on the collective behaviors that result from the local interactions of the individuals with each other and with their environment. Examples of systems studied by swarm intelligence are colonies of ants and termites, schools of fish, flocks of birds, and herds of land animals. Some human artifacts also fall into the domain of swarm intelligence, notably some multi-robot systems and also certain computer programs that are written to tackle optimization and data analysis problems. Ant colony optimization, particle swarm optimization, swarm-based network management, cooperative behavior in swarm of robots are examples of scientific and engineering swarm intelligence studies. Ant colony optimization algorithm is essentially a system based on agents which simulate the natural behavior of ants including mechanisms of cooperation and adaptation. Ants are capable of finding the shortest path between the food source and the nest without the use of visual information. This intriguing ability of the almost blind creatures has been extensively studied by ethologists. They discovered that in order to exchange information about which path should be followed, Ants communicate with one another by means of a chemical substance called pheromone. As ants move, a certain amount of pheromone is dropped on the ground, marking the path with a trail of this substance. The more ants follow a given trail, the more attractive this trail becomes to be followed by other ants. This process can be described as a loop of positive feedback, in which the probability that an ant chooses a path is proportional to the number of ants that have already passed by that path. In this example, three ants are on a journey to find a slice of cake. Each ant can choose to take any path with a uniform probability distribution. All ants move roughly at the same speed and deposit pheromone in a trail at roughly the same rate. The ant that took the shortest path will reach the nest faster than the other ants who chose to take a longer path to circumvent the obstacle. As a result, pheromone accumulates faster in the shortest path around the obstacle. And since ants prefer to follow trails with large amounts of pheromone, eventually, all the ants converge to the shorter path.
ACO algorithms are based on the following ideas. Each path followed by an ant is associated with a candidate solution for a given problem. When an ant follows a path, the amount of pheromone deposited on that path is proportional to the quality of the corresponding candidate solution for the target problem. When an ant has to choose between two or more paths, the path with a large amount of pheromone has a greater probability of being chosen by the ant. As a result, the ants eventually converge to a short path, hopefully the optimum or a near-optimum solution for the target problem. In essence, the design of an ACO algorithm involves the specification of the following, an appropriate representation of the problem which allows the ants to incrementally construct or modify solutions through the use of a probabilistic transition rule based on the amount of pheromone in the trail and on a local problem-dependent heuristic, a method to enforce the construction of valid solutions, that is, solutions that are legal in the real-world situation corresponding to the problem definition, a problem-dependent heuristic function that measures the quality of items that can be added to the current partial solution, a rule for pheromone updating which specifies how to modify the pheromone trail, and a probabilistic transition rule based on the value of the heuristic function and on the contents of the pheromone trail that is used to iteratively construct a solution. This is a pseudocode of a basic ACO procedure. Ant colony optimization algorithms have been applied to many combinatorial optimization problems ranging from quadratic assignment to fold protein or routing vehicles and a lot of derived methods have been adapted to dynamic problems in real variables, stochastic problems, multi-target and parallel implementations. It has also been used to produce near-optimal solutions to the traveling salesman problem. They have an advantage over simulated annealing and genetic algorithm approaches of similar problems when the graph may change dynamically. The ant colony algorithm can be run continuously and adapt to changes in real time. This is of interest in network routing and urban transportation systems. Here ends the presentation about ant colony optimization algorithm. No copyright violations were intended in producing this video. All references used are listed on the following slide.